Hi, this is Isabella de la Cruz here to give you this week's weather. This week, the whole week, it will be in the 70s, but Monday, Tuesday, and Friday, it will be a little bit cloudy. Happy Black History Month since the year of 1976, first being in 1915, half a century after the 13th Amendment abolished slavery in the United States. That same year, historian Carter G. Woodson and Minister Jesse E. Moreland founded the ASACH Association for Study of African American and History. Final low goes to the confusion cause when you are a baby coming into consciousness during a pandemic. Landry is just over a year old. She thinks every object attached to a wall is a Purell dispenser. She walks right up with her hands out, pretends to get a squeeze, and then rubs it right in just as she's been taught. When your first year of life is 2020, everything is a hand sanitizing station. But wouldn't you know it, when Landry finally gets to an actual dispenser here, She's too short to reach it. What's up, former flashes? It's Isaac Contero, aka Baby Chunks. Today I'll be telling you my top 10 rap, hip hop albums currently. Five from all time, five from currently. Let's get it. A two and one, Nothing Was the Same by Drake, and Take Care by Drake. That's it. No explanation. You know what Drake is? My goat, hopefully for yours. My opinion. Nothing else to be said. Just goaded. Drake's just goaded. J. Cole, 2014, Four Source Drives. Great album. Maybe a goat, you know? In the future, man, just talks about real stuff. Must, it's a must listen. We got Graduation by Kanye West. Amazing album. Throwback hits. Songs. Just overall good album. So listen. Come on now. Good Kid Mad City by Kendrick Lamar. Just talks about real stuff again. And uh, just just uh, overall good artist, you know? Yeah. So must listen. Culture by Migos. That's throwback right there. Middle school days. Everybody should bump Migos. And, um, you know, just overall classic. We got The Lost Boy by Corday. Another upcoming artist, you know, he just talks about real stuff, and uh, I'm telling you, he's a must-listen. He's going to be up there one day. Uh, true to myself, my little TJ, um, upcoming artist, Young, you know, his uh, music is a vibe. He could rap about slow love songs to, like, rap, you know, 
It's a very good artist. Must listen. Lil Durk, The Voice. Amazing artist. Upcoming. Young, you know. Talks about uh, street rap. You know, his life. You know, real stuff. You know, very sentimental. And um, But it's a very good um, artist coming up. It's a must listen. The Voice by Lil Durk. And last we got um, 2020's own. His big year, Lil Baby. Lil Baby's My Turn album. Just... Just an overall amazing artist. He's gonna be up there one day, maybe by Drake's era. Hopefully, give him a couple of years and uh, he'll be good. But overall, good artist, for his flow, everything. So, yeah, must listen. That is all for my top ten hip hop rap albums of my opinion. You know, um, thank you all for watching and uh, yeah, peace.